As part of its e-mobility strategy, Porsche is hoping that over 80% of all vehicle deliveries to consist of EVs in 2030. VW Group CEO, Oliver Bloom has confirmed that a pure electric Porsche 718 series is in the pipeline, which will include both Boxster and Cayman models. Show us your support by smashing the subscribe button so you don't miss any future videos by Top Electric SUV. Our renders of the next-gen Porsche Boxster have been mainly inspired by recent spy shots of the two-seat sports EV and the current-gen Taycan. We expect the front end of the Boxster Electric to get a low-slung wedge-shaped nose with rectangular headlights and sleek vertical side intakes, with other design elements likely including full-width LED rear lights and sporty-looking aero wheels. Our render of the next-gen Cayman Electric follows the general design language of its convertible stablemate while integrating a traditional coupe roofline. Both renders have the charging port located behind the front fender. The high-quality interior of the Porsche 718 EV should share a familiar layout, with sporty but comfortable seats and a sleek design for the dashboard, center console and AC vents. The cabin will likely have three digital displays, with the two central screens used to control various vehicle settings and the climate control system. The fully digital driver's display could be a curved OLED panel like in the current-gen Taycan, but perhaps more compact in size. Some of the features expected with the all-new sports cars consist of over-the-air software upgrades, wireless smartphone connectivity, dual-zone automatic climate control, powered and heated seats, multiple drive modes and chassis settings, launch control, my Porsche app with remote functions, and a premium audio system. The new 718 models will be built on the pure electric Porsche sports car platform, with the battery pack placed between the main cabin and the rear axle for optimum weight distribution and sporty handling. We expect the EVs to be offered in single-motor rear-wheel drive and dual-motor all-wheel drive configurations, while an 800-volt architecture could allow charging speeds of up to 270 kilowatts. There might even be a new 900-volt architecture with even faster charging speeds. Depending on the variant, the EPA-estimated range of the next-gen Boxster and Cayman could be around 250 to 300 miles on a single charge, while the sprint from 0 to 60 miles per hour is likely to take less than 4 seconds. We are expecting the new Porsche 718 EVs to be introduced in 2025, with starting prices likely ranging from around $75,000 to $80,000 for the coupe and convertible models respectively. Thank you for watching. If you haven't already, do click the subscribe button and the bell icon next to it.